I like you. How about it? I thought about it for a long time. I really don't know what to say. But I think this should be not bad. Ayin. Ayin, give some advice. I'm not feeling very well. I'm not worthy. You figure it out yourself. I'm going back. What are you talking about? You can't even walk straight. So strange. Help me with one more thing. Come here for a second. What are you doing? Since it's under the red luo tree to express one's feelings, I thought of something to say. Help me listen. <sighs> Ten years ago, the first time I saw you, from then on, actually in my heart, I've been thinking about you. Every time I see you, I think, I want to look a little longer. When I hear others mention you, I want to listen a little more. Today, the timing is just right. I want to tell you the words buried in my heart for 10 years. I like you. How about it? I thought about it for a long time. I really don't know what to say. But I think this should be not bad. Ayin. Ayin, give some advice. I'm not feeling very well. I'm not worthy. You figure it out yourself. I'm going back. What are you talking about? You can't even walk straight. Shigu, you finally woke up. Ah, uh, Yin, are you okay? I'm fine. You fainted because the Master Servant Pact acted up. Master Servant Pact acting up, that must be due to harboring thoughts contrary to the Pact. Ah, uh, Yin, let me ask you. You must answer truthfully. Do you wish to harm Ah, Jin? I do not. How could I harm him? Then do you... Have feelings for Arjun? How is that possible? Impossible. Then you should rest well. Ching Yi, Ajo, you two take good care of Ah Yin. Yes. Ching Yi, go make Ah Yin some chicken soup to nourish her. Hurry up. If it's nothing, then hurry back. I want to sleep. Today is the Chi Kiao Festival. I see the guests who came for the trial. Have all gone to the Milky Way to celebrate. How about we go to the Milky Way? Take a walk and relax? Really not going? All right. Then you sleep well. I'm leaving. Could it be... Ayin really likes Ajin? Why do you always think of Ajin? If someone finds out, it would be so embarrassing. Think about it. Ah Jin is a good-for-nothing heir. Never accomplishes anything. What's there to like? Even when he gets serious. Get serious. 
He seems to have that little bit of handsomeness. No, no. He orders you around at his will, unreasonable. But he desperately won the trial competition and saved my life. It seems no one else has ever been so good to you. Don't think it, don't think it. Can't keep thinking about him. I must find a way to forget him. Go out for a walk. So beautiful. Yes, so beautiful. Have you made your wish? I have. That star is so bright. Yes, look, there are many bright ones. Look, that one flies so high. And that one? They all say mine is the most beautiful. I think so too. The one you picked is beautiful. Of course. Come on, be careful. Let's go. How about it, beautiful, isn't it? Really beautiful. I should find a place where there are fewer people. Although this place is secluded, the scenery is exceptionally beautiful. I often think, if I had a beloved, I must bring her here. Emperor Lord has put thought into it. Emperor Lanfeng, then Ajin. Should cherish the one before him. This sign is exactly what's on my mind. And I hope. It's what you're thinking too. Hua Shu, rest assured, until your feelings are clear, I will not force you to make any response. I will wait until you can formally accept me. Do you still not understand my feelings, Your Highness? For two hundred years, this starlight has always encouraged me, just as you, Your Highness, whispered gently to me. Every time I think of it, I am grateful that I could meet you back then. But now I only wish that the conflict between the Eagle Tribe and my tribe would end soon. Only then can I freely talk to you about the future. Hua Shu. I will expedite the peace talks between your two tribes. By the way, today I have prepared a gift for you. Wait here for me for a moment. Why are you here? Shouldn't I be the one asking you that? Why are you here? You leave Ajin aside, and now you secretly meet with Emperor Lanfeng here. What do you mean? A lowly servant like you is also worthy to question the affairs of my palace. If you have no intention towards him, you should make it clear to him. You should not treat him so carelessly. What's the point in doing these things, being fickle and flirting around? Is that so? Then you just might have a chance to touch your master's heart. Does Gu Jin know that his lowly servant harbors delusions about him? Look at your foolish dreams. It's truly laughable. I know now. Could it be that you're afraid Ah Jin will take back the umbrella he lent you? That's why you're so vague and non-committal with him. You really have the mind of a petty person. I'm going to tell him right now.
Smooth talking and gossiping are not good habits. You come here to watch the lanterns in play, only seeing the beauty of this Milky Way, nothing else. When you return to the Magpie Feather Immortal Path, we'll forget everything about needing me. Huashu. Go ahead. The lady just now was... Just asking for directions. Here, this is for you. Am I beautiful? Beautiful. It is said that writing your wish on this lantern will make it come true. Really? Are you okay? No. There's something very important. But which thing? Your Highness, be careful. Ajin. Ah, Huashu, Your Highness. You're here. Ajin, ah, I suddenly had an attack of pain last night. I'm sorry for making you wait for nothing. Are you feeling better now? After taking the medicine, it's not a problem. I'm here to apologize. Today I wish to drink cheerfully with you. It's all right. It's not too late to wait until Your Highness has recovered. But... I want to know, what am I in your highness's heart? You're just a big fool! Ah, Yin! You keep silent first. She didn't show up last night to meet you. Not because of unbearable pain, but because she... Had another appointment! Another appointment? Ah, Yin, I don't know who you've been listening to. Who else did I supposedly have an appointment with? Please clarify. Do you really want me to say it? To make everyone embarrassed? So you mean to say you can't speak of it? Could it be that you drank too much last night? Why do you only have some vague fragments? Who exactly was she with? Ah, Yin. Ah, Yin, my lord suffered through the night with pain and endured all night. You can't just ruin his reputation with a few words. 
If you can't provide a proper explanation, please apologize to my lord immediately. I truly did see it. It's just that... I don't know how I have offended Ayin. Without any solid proof, yet you insist on this relentlessly. But I also cannot accept this slander without cause. Lady Ayin, do you dare to make a heart-reflecting oath? Place your hand here. This oath can reflect your heart. You merely need to speak of what you saw. If there's even a shred of fabrication, then you will suffer the agony of burning fire in your heart. Ah Yin! Princess Huashu, this heart-reflecting curse isn't something to be used lightly. Stop this at once, Ah Yin. What do you mean I'm being reckless? I really did see it. You don't believe me? Fine. If you don't believe me... Then it's my meddling. It's my meddling! Ah Yin! Ah Yin! Ah Yin! <laughs>